So first we will concentrate on u. So u is minus integration of x e raised to 2x upon e raised to 4x. In our case, x is nothing but e raised to 2x sec square x. So x is e raised to 2x sec square x into dx. This e raised to 2x and e raised to 2x will become e raised to 4x and this e raised to 4x and e raised to 4x will get cancelled and we get minus integration of x sec square x into dx. So here we are going to apply u into v rule of integration. What is u into v rule of integration? u integration of v minus integration derivative of u integration of v. So in our case u and v are this term so minus u will remain as it is that is x will remain as it is integration of sec square x is nothing but tan x minus integration derivative of u derivative of x is 1 and integration of sec square x is nothing but tan x into dx after this minus x tan x will remain as it is minus integration of tan x integration of tan x is nothing but log of sec x these are the direct formula we all know after this we take this negative sign inside we get u as minus x tan x plus log of sec x so this is our u after u we will find v this is our v and we have substituted x equal to e raised to 2x x square x so this e raised to 2x and e raised to 4x will get cancelled and we get only integration of sec square x dx what is integration of sec square x dx it is nothing but tan of x so our v is tan of x so after finding u and v we are going to substitute u and v in this equation so our yp is given by u into e raised to 2x plus v into x e raised to 2x so what is u u is nothing but minus x tan x plus log of sec x so u is minus x tan x plus log of sec x into this e raised to 2x plus what is v v is nothing but tan x so v is tan x and this term which is x e raised to 2x so after this we take this e raised to 2x inside we get minus x e raised to 2x into tan x plus e raised to 2x log of sec x plus this term which is x e raised to 2x tan x so if we observe these two terms these two terms are opposite and equal so these two terms will get cancelled and our yp will be nothing but e raised to 2x log of sec x so this is how we find yp in method of variation of parameters then our final solution will be y equal to yc plus yb we have found yc as c1 plus c2x into e raised to 2x plus yp which is e raised to 2x log of sec x so this is how we solve the problem on method of variation of parameters in exam it will be given like solve this problem by using a method of variation of parameters then you have to follow this procedure or else you can solve this problem by using e raised to ax into v type so more such problems we will see in our next video so stay tuned for our future lectures